The Sales Tax Setup tab gives you the ability to set up sales taxes for your company, regardless of where you are located. The first area handles taxes for customers in the United States. From this list, you should add taxes to the states that your items are shipped from. If your company has shipping locations in different states, you may add as many states as required. Make sure that all of the states you want to include for taxation purposes appear on the list on the right side. In most states, the law is that you should charge your sales tax rate only to those customers whose shipping address state is a state where your company ships from. Each state's current tax rate will automatically come up, but you have the option to change the rate. In addition to changing the rate, you are also given the choice to charge tax on shipping. This can be done by selecting the tax shipping box before adding the state to the list. Please check with your state laws about taxing shipping charges. Canadian merchants have a complete setup for the various Canadian sales taxes. Choose between using GST and PST for each province or use the HST rate. You can also set individual percentages for each tax type and tax shipping charges. The International Value Added Tax, or VAT tax, is used by many different countries as a national sales tax. Look for the country where you need to charge VAT and set the specific tax amount before adding it to the list. If your company charges VAT tax to different countries, add the different countries by selecting them from the drop-down menu and clicking the Add button. Similar to the U.S. state tax and Canadian tax setup, you can also choose to tax the shipping. The Surtax by Postal Code button allows you to specify additional surtax percentages based on your customer's zip or postal code. This can be useful if the counties in your state have different tax rates. You can choose to enter them manually or use the Fortune 3's Wizard Import Export tool to quickly import all of your surtaxes. You can proceed to the next section by clicking on Next.